The following preview has been rated X for exports. They said it would happen when pigs fly. Well, guess what? A hotel room in our nation's capital. A few hand-chosen leaders gather to hatch an ambitious plan that will change the world. Meetings are held, deals are made, agreements are signed, hands are shaken. Their goal? To create an international organization designed to influence the decisions of governments worldwide, to capitalize and profit in the global marketplace. To insiders, the organization is known as the Council. Before long, the Council has established outposts around the world and quietly, but effectively, goes about its work in every corner of the globe. A poultry operation in Morocco, a dairy in China, a water buffalo farm in Egypt, a fish farm in Vietnam, pork production in Mexico, a horse ranch in Australia. From Latin America to the Middle East, from West Africa to the Pacific Rim. If a market exists or one can be created, the Council is there. In a world where 96% of the population lives outside the United States, one organization stands alone in its quest to command the global marketplace for American corn, sorghum, barley, and their co-products. The U.S. Grains Council. Be there this July when the Council officially kicks off its 50th anniversary celebration. Join us in historic Boston, Massachusetts for the 50th annual Board of Delegates meeting of the U.S. Grains Council. Be part of this important event and golden anniversary celebration and witness the premiere of a powerful video presentation that chronicles the five-decade international impact that the Council has had on America's corn, sorghum, and barley producers. The U.S. Grains Council, a coalition of commodities, a gang of three, the Axis of Access. The U.S. Grains Council, 50 years of leadership, acting on opportunities. This summer, the story will be told.